Hey everybody, Tina Valentine Belfi here, paparazzi consultant number 51987. I just wanted to do this quick video to show y'all how to do the garment rack display for your jewelry. Um, I've already showed you the supply list in my blog post and now I'm going to show you how to put it all together. So you've got your plywood, you got your strips, you got your hooks, you got your garment rack, you've got your S hooks, and these are like, they're kind of beefy, but you need these because your jewelry gets really heavy, so you want to get the, you know, don't skimp on these. You don't want it falling down in the middle of a presentation. But this rack is really good for, it's really portable, it's really quick to put together, and it's just really easy. Um, you can use it at home parties, you can use it at your house to have some displays up for when people come over, because your friends are going to come over and they're going to want to shop. I've already figured that out. Every time anybody comes to my house, they're like straight to my studio and they want to shop. So anyways... Let me show you how to put all this together. These are your Velcro strips, the one wraps, and they come in a big roll. You only need a few of them for your project, but let me tell you, they come in handy in a lot of other places too. I've used them everywhere. So you got it hooked together up here, and then you've got your, wall, your hooks from the wall peg store, and you got your little S hooks down here on your rack, and then I'm just using a smaller, uh, smaller boards for the demonstration here. But um, in the first couple times you do this, it's going to be kind of tight, but it's okay. You don't want to go with anything smaller because, like I said, your jewelry gets really heavy hanging on here, and you don't want it to fall apart. You just hook it on here like that, and there you go. You've got your display. Of course, yours will be bigger if you use the dimensions and everything. Get your 4 by 8 sheet of pegboard and um, cut it to the dimensions that I put in the blog post. And that's over at valbellsboutique.com. And I hope you have enjoyed this video. I've enjoyed making it for you, and I hope you get some use out of it. If you need any more information, don't hesitate to comment. Or if you just want to comment, that's fine too. All right, thanks. I will talk to you again soon. Bye.